Hello and welcome to the 7 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Sarah the Brick. His Royal Highness, the Crown Prince Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa today received the United Kingdom's Defence Senior Advisor to the Middle East, Lieutenant General Sir John Lorimer, at Ghalibiya Palace. During the meeting, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince highlighted the long-standing ties between Bahrain and the United Kingdom, noting the advanced level of bilateral cooperation between the two countries in promoting regional security and stability. The meeting was attended by the Minister of Finance and National Economy, Sheikh Salman bin Khalifa Al Khalifa, and the Bahrain Defense Force Chief of Staff, Lieutenant General Diab bin Sagr Al Naimi. Her Royal Highness, the wife of His Majesty the King, President of the Supreme Council for Women, Princess Sabika bint Ibrahim Al Khalifa, sent a cable of congratulations to the President of the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities, Sheikh Hamay bint Mohammed Al Khalifa, where she expressed pride in winning the Cultural and Scientific Achievement Award from the Sultan bin Ali Al Awais Foundation. Her Royal Highness expressed pleasure with this honor, which comes in recognition of Sheikh Hamay's influential and remarkable contributions in the service of the national culture, which reflects the intellectual and cultural heritage as one of the most important features of Bahrain civilization. Her Royal Highness expressed pride and appreciation for the efforts of Sheikh Hamey and her valuable contributions. The seventh edition of the Global Health, Safety and Environment Conference and Exhibition organized by Iconex in coordination with the National Oil and Gas Authority and with the support of Saudi Aramco, Bahrain National Gas Company and many local, regional and international companies was inaugurated yesterday under the patronage of the oil minister, Sheikh Mohammed bin Khalifa Al Khalifa and will go on until October 3rd in the Gulf Hotel. More on this report. A conference focused on health, safety and environment issues in the oil and gas industry opened last night in the kingdom. The seventh edition of the Global Health, Safety and Environment Conference and Exhibition is being held under the patronage of the oil minister, Sheikh Mohammed bin Khalifa Al Khalifa, and will continue until Thursday at the Gulf Hotel. Health, safety and the environment is uh, forever a growing topic in the industry, uh, oil and gas, but... Uh, other industries, we have ALBA participating, we have oil companies in GCC, and the health, health and the safety of people working in, the, in this industry is paramount, very important, and you have to continuously upgrade your uh, practices, train young, the young generation, uh, look at best practice, make sure you have all the resilient systems, the environment is now very important controls of emissions, making sure that people live in better environments, the well-being of people, not just their well-being in the, in the workspace, but their well-being at home as well is, is very important for ultimately what's best for the, these companies and organizations. But this is where uh, conferences like these are focused on and we have of course uh, high level and senior people from across the region which tells you uh, the importance of this, uh, this topic. The whole world is talking about sustainable development. The key for sustainable development and the backbone for sustainable development is health, safety and environment. And we are extremely proud that uh, under the patronage of uh, His Excellency, uh, the Minister of Oil in the Kingdom of Bahrain, we are holding the biggest safety event uh, in the Middle East more than 2,000 plus uh, delegates from all over the world. Hundreds of speakers are gathering here. The importance of healthy health and safety and environment cannot be overemphasized. We have seen in the recent events in the region and around the world. The International Global Health, Safety, Environment Conference and Exhibition is themed as HSE Excellence, Efficiency, Resilience and Sustainability and it provides the attendees with the opportunity to take a deep dive into the insights of health, safety and environment as they hear from over 100 global industry leaders about the future of HSE culture across industries around the globe. I think Bahrain now it is a leading in HSE in the, in the, in the region and globally if you go to the industry now uh, like uh, uh, aluminium and petroleum companies uh, now they are rewarded by global uh, recognitions and this is really proud for, for Bahrain uh, among the region so it is the hub 
where we are driving our industries, it is HSA. I really appreciate uh, Bahrain for hosting such an event uh, to introduce all companies and to, to show uh, what they are doing in preventing accidents in, uh, in their, with their workforce and prevent the loss to our lovely environment in the country that we all share and, and need to save. The Global HSE 2019 conference will mark its seventh edition in the Kingdom of Bahrain, where HSE professionals from all across the globe will converge their knowledge to lead the future of HSE practices. The event will witness leaders of the industry who will deliver sessions on the sustainable business practices underlining the socio-economic excellence. Reporting for Bahrain International, I'm Yasmin Ibrahim.